Meghan and Harry first public appearance of the year virtual poetry class. Fans were overjoyed to see Meghan again. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have made their first appearance this year, when they completely surprised a poetry class over the weekend. Prince Harry and Meghan took the time out to honor Black History Month and show their support for Get Lit, which is a literary group that describes its work as empowering youth and emboldening communities. The group shared about their notable guests visit on Twitter, guess who surprised our poetry class this weekend. It was the best weekend ever. Harry and Meghan were magic and kind and interested in poetry. The Duchess even shared some of her favorite poetry lines. We are so grateful for their visit in honor of Black History Month. This is the first appearance we have seen of the couple during an event since the 14th of December. Meghan last made a surprise appearance on a CNN Heroes special and delivered remarks in a pre-taped segment that aired in mid-December to celebrate those who have supported others amid the pandemic. In a year that has been universally challenging for everyone, I'm inspired by the stories of compassion in our communities. Across the country, people have put their own needs aside to come together and support the collective well-being of those around them, Prince Harry's wife said. Back in March, the crisis hit hard, and overnight everything seemed to change. For many families, the impact of the pandemic has been catastrophic. And far too many were faced with a heartbreaking question, how am I going to put food on the table for my family? But in the face of this devastating reality, we also saw the power of the human spirit. And the remarkable ways that communities respond in challenging times. We saw the good in people, in our neighbors and in entire communities coming together. To say they would not stand by while our neighbors went hungry, she continued. These moments reminded so many that they are cared for. Tonight, we are celebrating these quiet heroes, some of whom I know and others that we applaud from afar. These individuals stood up and made sure the most basic needs of our communities were met. They made sure those around them did not have to suffer in isolation. They nourished their neighbors in more ways than one, the mother of one said. And they showed us, all of us, that even in the darkest times, when we come together, we have the power to remind someone else that there is hope, and that we will be okay. Meghan and Prince Harry shared some of their favorite lines of poetry. The couple made a surprise appearance in honor of Black History Month on Saturday, joining a virtual poetry class with Get Lit, an organization that promotes literacy and empowers young people through poetry. Guess who surprised our poetry class this weekend? It was the best weekend ever. The organization captioned a screenshot of the duo joining their Zoom call with some shocked reactions from other participants. Prince Harry and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, were magic and kind and interested in poetry. Getlet said that Meghan shared some of her favorite lines of poems and dubbed the most epic experience in Getlet history. Teacher Mason Granger shared on Instagram why Meghan and Prince Harry joined the class. The root of them deciding to come is because at some point in their lives, they were moved by a poem, he said. And whoever wrote that poem at some point thought to themselves. Does this even matter? Is anyone even listening and they shared it anyway? He continued, fast forward ripple 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 and these kids get a surprise 45 minute chat with the Prince Harry and Meghan. It was pretty surreal. Granger said that the kids were able to share poems and ask Meghan and Harry questions. He even commented that the couple took the time to actually read and learn the kids by sight sent earlier. Get Lit was founded in 2006 after Diane Luby Lane and the curriculum has expanded to over 100 schools throughout California as well as being sold to schools around the world. The organization's Instagram post included the hashtags Black Lives Matter, BLM and Black History Month. Following the killing of George Floyd, Meghan gave an emotional surprise address. During the virtual graduation ceremony of a former school, Immaculate Heart High School in the Los Feliz neighborhood of Los Angeles. In her speech, she told the students, the only wrong thing to say is to say nothing. Meghan and Harry have also been talking to community leaders about how they can both learn more and contribute to the Black Lives Matter movement. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.